Heard from the lasses down on 22 that you did a contract for sublight. Only one, a legit haul. Smashed up a freighter out in the Charybdis belt. You ever stop to wonder how it got smashed up? Asking questions is a good way to forfeit my bonus. Some things ain't worth knowing. Hey there, Captain. Anything I can do for you? Be seeing you. to your local manager about applying for military training and lend your life to protecting our world. Okay, so what are we drinking? You're the expert. Oh, and don't worry on the price. I got this. Let's just do it proper. Oh, no, that's just... that's on account of my not being able to sleep lately. Makes my hands all twitchy, you know? I've just been lying awake, thinking about what Jun Lei said, and... I'm feeling my heart shake. Well, that's fruit and such, right? Okay, wine it is. Bottoms up. Good choice for getting sloshed when you want to act fancy about it. Wow, this is really kind of nice, actually. Who'd have guessed old fruit could taste so good? Oh, Captain, I'm pining for June like something fierce. What am I doing? You're funny. Yeah, I guess we're doing that, aren't we? Crewing together, seeing the stars. It's like something out of a serial. I like the ones with grand romances. And I think... I think I'm flubbing mine. I don't know what to do about... us. Well, she talked about another girl, right? Isabel. Mentioned her by name and everything, like she wanted me to know. Maybe I've been making a right fool of myself this whole time. Maybe she's not interested after all. Exactly. Takes a lot of trust to hand over that kind of blackmail material. Uh, I, I don't know. I'd call it uh, sensual, that's... a lot. Date? Oh dear, I hadn't... really... Oh my goodness. And I told you? Let's read it right now, just to be sure. It was real long and rambly. She was telling me a story about her dad, how a lady named Isabel did all sorts of things to try to win his favor. This Isabel lady never quite managed to get her dad's approval, but they carried on anyways. Made something good out of a bad situation. Then it all went down the tubes. Do you think June Lay still has feelings for her? 
I just got a lot of feelings, Captain, and they're all climbing up my throat. I, I need another drink. Right now. Before I lose my nerve. Come on, Captain. I'm here to drink. Okay, maybe you're right. I'm a little woozy. Hydration, here I come. Aw, this was just about to get fun. Shush you. Oh, Captain. I want to talk to Junlei all the time. Even about silly things, but... Oh, I'm so scared. Um, everything? I got a solar system's worth of terrifying questions swirling around my head. Does she think I'm as pretty as I think she's handsome? What if she doesn't like me? What if she does? What if she's still got feelings for that lady, Isabel? What if we... we get together and... she gets bored of me? Don't you tease me in my moment of weakness. You know I'm not interested in physical affection. That's... Well, it's tripped folks up in the past. Folks I thought cared about me for me. What if she's not okay with that? What if she is, but then later, she's not? What do you mean, Captain? So if I'm doing my very best to be kind and open-hearted, I shouldn't worry how she thinks of me? Gosh, I don't know that I got that in me. Sometimes I feel real mean inside, Captain. I think... ungenerous thoughts. Yeah, yeah. I like the way you put that, that, but it's okay, okay to want to want to better for her. I'm not supposed to try. Well, Captain, this is this has been... This, this is, been, this is this his whole life I got, just... just wow, wow. So, so much is about that. Oh, gosh, I... I don't know, Captain. Do you think I should? All right. There's no need to strip your screws over it. Okay. I, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna ask June out. Just as soon as we get back to the ship. I mean, probably. Eventually. Thanks for hearing me out and giving me counsel. And, well, for being a friend. It means a whole lot. You're good people, Captain. This was fun. We should do it again after you send that message. Oh, all right. Thank you, guys. You're real good friends, you know that? I wish... I wish there was a place we could all live quiet together. Come on, let's go. What do you recommend? Glass or... Rizzo's purple berry punch, salt, flour, tahi, swamp, aroma, sweet purple berry flavored scent. Have either of these salt cruises ever put it? Adventuring is tiring work. Hey, Captain. I hope I wasn't too much bother at the bar. I did have fun, and I tried some things I never would have otherwise. Some of the drinks we tried I even liked. I guess it's not all disgusting. And I don't feel it today. I guess that water must have worked. I'm glad I had you looking out for me.
I messaged Junlei when we got back, and she replied super quick. <clears throat> okay. I was awake half the night, thinking about what I sent, anxious to see what you said. I reread my message in the morning, and it was unclear. I was drinking when I sent it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have had the courage. Also, sorry for the typos. Oh, she called mashed potatoes smashed potatoes, but I think maybe that's just what they call them on Groundbreaker. I've ruined things in the past because I didn't say things I should have, like I've met someone who's become special to me. I want to be honest with her, so if she feels the same about me, there won't be any surprises. Like one of those two-bit romances where one soul's all stiff and formal and I should be glad to perhaps take hold of your hand, miss. I ought to go write her back. I mean, I already did. Twice. <laughs> but anyhow, thanks for taking me out, Captain. Sometimes I can hear Vickers saying prayers to himself. Sometimes I hear him cussing about toss ball scores. 